So this is my race car, last day, and um, it's a little bit bittersweet, but uh, you know, that's how things go. This here is a, a 1988 BMW 325 IS, um, turned into a spec E30 race car. It's a uh, pretty restrictive class, you know, with the, it's just stock set of suspension, the, the Bilstein's, H&R race springs, motor, stock, you can't really do anything to it, um, except for refresh it and, uh, you know, you put like a straight pipe on. Um, very basic car, we run them up in Northern California. Uh, we get a lot of people doing it. This is mine, I built it uh, a few years ago. I got three seasons out of it. Uh, one, just building it up and doing uh, HPDE stuff, uh, track days while I got my racing license, and then ran two full seasons. Last season, uh, or 2012, uh, me and a buddy uh, won the Pro-Am race that we had set up that year. So we got first place there, won a little bit of cash actually, that felt good. Uh, had a lot of fun with it, but selling it now this is the last day, so I'm getting ready to deliver it to a guy. I feel good that I was able to build up a car and uh, actually sell it for some money at the end. I didn't ball it up and have to rebuild the entire thing, so that's good. In my opinion, Spec E30 is a great series. These are fun cars. Um, it usually comes down to like a Miata or this. I definitely prefer this. They're fun cars because uh, for one, they, they're dope, they look rad, you know, front engine, rear wheel drive, um, they're the boxy that I like, uh, it's just a good style, it's like the old DTM cars and everything. As far as racing in the series, uh, we're lucky and in NorCal we have a great group, even getting up to 30 cars at some point. super close. Uh, I mean racing in general is just like an unbelievable blast. There's nothing like driving on the track for one. Like that's an eye-opening experience the first time and then getting into racing it's like a whole nother level. Going through turns like you know going through the S's at Sonoma side by side with people just freaking I mean it's like adrenaline just pinned for 30 minutes. Um, and you know, there's scuffs on the side of this car. We're getting really close, bumping side to side, but it's all, I mean, the competition's really good. Most of the time it's fair. Um, and so we're lucky to have some really good uh, racers up in Northern California running a good series. Uh, ups and downs through the whole thing, you know, little repairs here and there. Uh, I was doing it as cheap as you possibly could, I think, without sponsorship. And um, it was still super expensive. My credit's a little bit worse at the end of it, but um, I'd say that's worth it. I'll, I can try to rebuild that. Um, so good experience overall, and I'm just gonna see what's next. You know, it's one fun part is being a car guy or whatever, like, you know, this was a rad experience, not the end. We'll sell this, I don't know. We'll see, uh, see what we can patch together for something else fun next. <laughs>